Hello, welcome back to another episode of the GeoGuessr Daily Challenge. Three silvers in a row now, not great, not great. Um, let's do it today, let's do it, alright. Seems like... Hmm, Malaysia? Possibly? I don't know. This is a strange one. This is a strange one. Lorong Air Tom that says, I'm trying to figure out kind of what it feels like. I mean, it's got these flags. It almost weirdly feels, I mean, Bhutan has those flags everywhere. But is it Bhutan? I don't think. Berehenti and we're driving on the left. It definitely could be Malaysia. I think it says Berehenti in Malaysia for stop. It's just weird. I'm not used to this kind of look. Very strange. But yeah, I think... Does that say Pedang? Penang. Yeah, there's the Malaysian flag. Okay. Confirmed. Um, strange one. Strange one. Only reason I even mentioned um, Bhutan was because of the colorful flags that were hanging across. Something you see a lot over there. But obviously, that's not the only place you can see them. Uh, let's look for Selamat. That has to be a place that's findable. Selamat. Huh. Could it be over here? Sarawak? I don't think so. I don't think so. I feel pretty good about this one. Even if I might not find it, I think I'm in the right area. Selamat and... Island, possibly. I know I neglected to check these islands in the past. I don't know if that's actually part of Malaysia, that one that I just zoomed in on. Salamat. That's such a Malaysian-sounding... Datang. Uh, such a Malaysian-sounding name, <laughs> isn't it? Penang. Penang. Can I find that? Possibly. Segamat. Oh, it's so similar. <laughs> um, I'm going to go up closer towards Kuala Lumpur. Just to be kind of closer towards the middle of the country in a way. Um, 29 seconds. We really ran out of time here. Penang? Wait, hold on. Penang, Penang. I think it said Penang somewhere else. I'm like pretty sure this is it. Not going to lie. Georgetown, it would make sense. Selamat, Taman, Selamat. Are we around here? We might, we might have figured this one out. We sure did. Perfect. Yeah, I'm glad I, I'm glad that I kept looking there. Definitely, definitely paid off. Cool. Next one. Um, feels European. We have blue. On the license plate, that just straight up says Estonia. So, <laughs> I think we are in Estonia. The language there on that stop thing checks out. The colors. Oh, and there's the flags. Yeah, that, that's what I was looking at. Vabamu. Whatever that says. Museum of Occupations and Freedom. Vabamu, Estonia. Cool. So, where are we, though? I mean, this could easily just be Tallinn. Um, Tallinna. Is that what they call it? I believe there is an A on the end in Estonian. Um, in the Estonian, like, pronunciation or spelling or whatever. Um, looking for something that I can recognize at the moment. Something better than those signs, because I didn't actually know what they are pointing towards. Here's a huge thing. What is this? We, this is going to help a lot. Easty. Uravrusramatukogu. Yeah, that probably sounds really funny to an Estonian person, but to me, I'm trying my hardest. Yeah. Isti, Rahu something. So let's first go in here. What are our main cities? Tallinn, Tartu, right? Um, sorry if I left one out and you're from there and you're like sad. I can only know so much. Um, I don't think that building really helps, not gonna lie. Kinsvara, 
Kinisvara. That's a place. Is that the island? No. Is that a city? I think it's a city. Kinisvara. Real estate. Or slash real estate. Shoot. Maybe Kinisvara just means real estate. Damn it. <laughs> oh, man. This is a huge city, though. I'd be surprised if this wasn't Tallinn. Tallinn? Talina. I'll say all three every time. Um, I don't know how to find out either. That's the weird part. Here we go. Some highways. The four and the one. And Tallinn is not on the sign, so it makes sense if it's... So here's the four. The one goes this way as well. The four, the one, the E20. So I'm assuming this is, yeah, E20 here. Yeah, we got to be around here. There's like a big government building or something, right? Probably like around here then. This? Museum? Ah, the other side of town. Eh, not too bad, not too bad. Kind of nailed it. Next up, let's see. Eastern Europe, Central Europe. Um, it just has the look. It has a look. There's an Uber. Very interesting. Let's just go looking for some clues here. Could be even Russia, actually. This, yeah. This view, plus the Cyrillic, plus all of this, screams Russia. It's got a white license plate with no EU. Those two cars had white. I think that's white. Just white. Russia. Not what I wanted to see. Russia is the killer of good rounds, as we know. Um, what do you even do in this situation? I think I've nearly lost my ability to read um, Cyrillic stuff. So, like, what is this? Uh, office? Office, yeah. Um, this sounds good. What is that? Mohaiskopo. That doesn't help. Um, well, damn it. I don't want to go that way. There's nothing that way. Let's keep going on this one. See if we can find some highway signs towards other places and just kind of make a guess because Russia sucks. I'm sorry. It's too big. It's just too big. It's impossible to find where you're going. I think that just said stop that sign there. Unless I'm crazy. Um, yeah, it definitely just said stop. Um, wow, not a red stop sign. They have like a different just white rectangle stop sign. Um, hmm, this could help. Um... Dostavka, Dostavka, E, um, what is the Y? I don't know, I'm just going to say Istanovka, Omsk, holy shit. I'm like trying to read the, um, where's Omsk? I'm like trying to read the, the, the other text here and literally it says GM Omsk right there, Omsk, which is of course a city. Um, could also be a region, though. I'm a little worried that it's a region. Omsk Oblast? Yeah, it so could be. Oh, and we would lose a ton of points if we were not in Omsk or near it. Um, well, we tried. Let's see. Hey! <laughs> we were actually just south of Omsk in a little bit of a more uh, suburban area, I guess you could say. Cool. Next up, um, looking like Southeast Asia. There you go, Thailand. There's the flag. Uh, we can see it right there. Let's go this way. It looks pretty good for stuff to see. Oh, here's a good uh, good one right away. Nope, not a good one. Doesn't help. I'm not going to be searching for those places. Let's see this one. Nope, doesn't help. 
I'm not wasting my time on these ones anymore. Bangkok, Sa Saraburi. So that helps. Uh, I take it back. <laughs> so Bangkok and Saraburi are uh, to our south. Saraburi is this way. So maybe we're here. I don't know. Lopburi is also along the way. Oh, there's Lopuri. So we're up here then? Kainat? Wait, what did that last one say? Hold on. This could be good. I'm like 99% sure one of the signs said Kainat. Chainat. Something. I don't know how you would pronounce that, but... Kaibadan. Oh. So here's Kainat. Um... Lam Santi is one way. Uh, Chayafum is another way. Don't see those places. Feel good about China right now. Thep Thepsa Thit and Lam Santi. No. Hey, we're going to be close either way. All right, we got 52 seconds. Let's not waste it. Let's keep going. Take some water. Um, I want to read this. Tourist Services Center. Okay, but tourists of where? Tourists to where? Oh, wait, hold on. This could tell us. Nope, that doesn't say anything. This one might tell us. Let's back, back up one little bit. Nope, it doesn't. Can't read that. A little bit worrying. Here's another one for us to look at. Lam Santi is north. Kaibadan is north. Um, Nong Bua Rawa. Rawe. Oh my god, look at all the places. Holy crap. Wow. All right, we were out in the middle of nowhere. Jeez. Even out here in a place that's almost not visible on the map, it's pretty densely populated. Southeast Asia population is incredible to me. Wow. 500 points lost. Not too bad. All right, last round here. Uh, looking like the U.S. or Canada. Right off the bat. Leaning U.S. on this one. But I'm not too sure. Let's try to leave the neighborhood. No outlet it said on those, so obviously we're not going to go that way. Oh, and it's bad camera. Okay, better camera. Whew. License plate? Oh, this is good. This is good. Do oh, Ohio. Toledo, Ohio. Well, there you go. Let's go into Ohio in here. Toledo. 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 Cool. And off to find more information. Wow. What a good find there. That truck is blessed. You guys should order. If you're nearby, order from them. Because they just gave me a good score. Unless they're like super far from home and I get a bad score, then don't. <laughs> okay. Um. So. Rand Rudy's Hot Dogs. Maybe we can go find Rudy's Hot Dog. Glendale, Cass Road. Or Eastgate. Glendale and Eastgate. Are we going to be able to find that? Probably not. Just kind of looking at the names of the gridded major roads here. Ah, oh, we're getting kind of far away, aren't we? Yeah. Now, could Glendale be in the name of a place as well over here? Yeah, we might be in a distant town, a nearby town. I'm not too sure. We got a minute 11 left. Just trying to figure out what's the best way to go. I think I'm going to go that way. Can't go that way. Quite interesting. Cass Road. We're on Cass Road. Cass Road is not very populated. I'd like to go on the main road, please. Yes. Cass Road. But what is this main one that we're on? Glendale. Glendale and Cass. Can I find Cass? 
thought I saw it actually, weirdly. Maybe I'm like forced, like, not forcing myself, tricking myself. Here's Glendale. There's Eastgate and Cass. Um, so if that's the case, we started from the hot dog place and we're south of it. Um, Rudy's Hot Dogs, where are you at? There's Rudy's, so we started back. Um, we came out of 18 seconds. We made a right. This is, come on, 11 seconds. Blackthorn. Oh, why did it zoom me all the way out? Why did it do that? Oh, that's messed up, man. Blackthorn down here. <laughs> okay. There we go. I, I did it. 24,490 is our score. That's a beautiful gold. We lost only about 500 points, 510 to be exact. And that's one for the books out of the thousand people that played. Um, yeah, there was m like 1,600. Was it like 1,600 people when I started? Either way, 13th place. That's amazing. I feel really good about that one. Anyway, that's going to do it. So if you enjoyed, please leave a like down below. Subscribe for the other GeoGuessr videos and leave a comment. Let me know if you maybe beat me. Are you one of these 12 people um, on today's daily? I'll see you tomorrow.